British Columbia. Canada's third largest and westernmost province is home to nearly 600 species of birds, 500 species of fish, and some of the most spectacular animals on planet Earth. The dense forests and bountiful rivers at Butte Inlet, right off the coast of Vancouver Island, make a perfect home for one mammal in particular, Ursus arctos horribilis, otherwise known as the grizzly bear. As summer nears end and salmon make their way up the river to spawn, the grizzly bear will spend a large portion of its day fishing and searching the riverbanks for food. It's time to fatten up for winter. At this time, they can consume more than 100,000 calories in a single day. Although the grizzly is known for its massive paws and sharp claws, they are surprisingly dexterous, able to delicately hold items and peel the skin off a fish with great precision. As incredibly efficient eaters, when food is abundant, the bears will only eat the skin, brain and eggs of a salmon which are packed with fat and other nutrients. No time to be wasted on picking apart the rest of the fish. Beyond the regulation of the population of their prey, grizzly bears play an important role in our delicate ecosystem. By dragging salmon out of the rivers and through the forests, they are inadvertently nourishing the soil. Whatever is left over from the bear's meal will decay and add important nitrogen back into the earth. These processes are so connected that scientists have found that they can use the health of the forest to gauge the health of the nearby river's salmon run. The vastly spread forests of British Columbia cover almost 64% of the province, making for a perfect home for these territorial giants who prefer to spend their time roaming alone. But this particular bear appears to be fishing for two. Although the grizzly bear prefers to eat alone, at certain times of the year when food is plentiful, dinner guests are met with caution, but welcomed. The search continues. A grizzly cub will slowly gain its independence as it learns to hunt on its own, but it will be under close watch by its mother for up to the first three years of its life. The cub will rely on her for food and protection from predators such as cougars, wolves, and even other bears. This baby bear isn't quite ready to be out on its own. Over the course of a century, the grizzly bear has been eliminated from 98% of its historical range. Since then, thanks to conservation efforts and protected land, the grizzly bear population has become more stable in some areas, but more work needs to be done to ensure their future. Today, there are approximately 55,000 grizzly bears in North America, and about one quarter of that population, called British Columbia, home. 